All right, people, we are back. So, well, this is match three. This is this is for all the marbles, people. So, of course, we already know what it is. It's Evil Swarm versus Madote. So, ooh. oh, that might <laughs> open up well for Tyler. I mean, that's even, even though, I mean, Evil Swarms. I know they have like k k searchy cards, like they have the rotors for their casters and shit like that, but they still have consistency issues. I put them in the same boat as Ritual Beast. They have a searcher card. As in Ritual Beast have like searcher card as an e tally for their tamers. But they can still break. Mm hmm So that's a cool Ophion. It'd be a shame if it got Tiramisu. So hopefully you got some background to back that up. A little yeah. bit of Fiendish Chain, a little bit of Solemn Warning, maybe some Capulse, some Bottomless. I don't care, but please do not allow Luna to just go off on your ass. Knowing Luna, he probably opened up with Kitty Cat and Angeli. Like, oh, here we go. <laughs> yeah, oh, let's go. And Dotes are not that. Definitely, definitely, Medotes will be moving up to Tier 2 next season. Because we completely forgot about them. They're, they're that underground Tier 2. Mm -hmm. Alright, and D-Fisher. Oh, okay. Cute. But... Alright, one of them's a Pandemic. Damn. Damn. Oh, damn. Right, well, that's pretty much standard Evil Swarm, yep. isn't it? Yeah, Pandemic to back row. Set your D -fisher. hand. Yep. Make an Ophion set your hand, pretty much. That's typical Evil Swarms. So, hopefully, Maho will be able to lock it down with enough back row. <clears throat> Just gonna take it slow with the Angeli. Alright. Alright. <laughs> you mean Magdalene? Oh, yeah, Magdalene. My bad. Magdalene's searching Angeli, right? No, your cakes! Yes. Magdalene's gonna cakes, search for Angeli. Then. See, I was already thinking ahead. I was already thinking ahead. Uh huh. Right, yeah. right. Watch, search for Angeli. Oh! Daniel's too smart. He knows the future. This ain't post recording. This is live, people. <laughs> no, that was obvious. Obvious play is obvious. <laughs> so, of course, as you guys know, Madoches, they usually go shuffle back to deck, but they gotta be sent to the graveyard first, in which, of course, Steve Fisher, they're not going back. So, yeah. there is no uh, Magdalene going back. <laughs> just, so, uh, that gone. Deep Fisher, that D Fisher might fuck him over, because if he doesn't have him. Madolce in the fucking grave to begin with, you can't do Angeli's effect. Not Angeli, you can't do um, Tiramisu's effect. Oh no, now you got one. Because it's Madolce card. <laughs> so, so. Looks like that maybe Mal was trying to snipe out the, <laughs> the Royal Decree. But if you know Lunar Main Dex, like I said, a Royal Decree is a Tiramisu, we'll just go ahead and. I don't know it why out. he tried to snipe it. I would have just waited till the Luna flipped it and then have gone and I spaced it personally, but. Yeah. But maybe it looks like Luna's about to have his cake think, and eat I think it too. The time, I think the time of MST sniping is really done with nowadays. I mean, let's face it. When do you want to MST snipe? When they set one bat row, really, and that's it. Yeah. Or any other, time, any other time, you might as well just set the space and then wait for him to flip something up or play something continuous. It's it's be either that or when you're about to And then you just blow it up. Yeah, when you're about to push for a play. You know, yeah. like, alright, well, I'm about to push, my opponent has one back row. Yeah, I know, but in that situation, it was... Because you nasty. don't want to run into, like, a Capulse or a Bomb West where, you know, and if he doesn't negate. But, you know, if you can go ahead and squeeze that in on a Fiendish Chain, that's not bad. Yep, mm. that's banished. Go ahead and smack him with that, uh, Thunderbird. So, no, this is the moment, this is... It's the moment of truth right here. There it is. <laughs> yeah. So you want to go ahead and respond? You got another space? No? Alright, well you yeah. fucking lose. So there's, I mean, we, only, we know that there's only one back row back there, the other one's Pandemic, and yeah, it looks on. like <laughs> they're just ready to go to town. I mean, he's still going to get fucked up thanks to that d fish but... Alright, I was about to see. Go to town? Luna? You know, what's I, I mean, I don't think he's, I don't personally think he can. Sorry, I just don't. <laughs> okay. That's what you think. Yeah. Actually, you know, Luna's gonna be like, normal summon, active in diffusion, summon a four, go into Castell, spin back that Ophion, slap that Thunderbird in the face. Maybe. I mean, uh, he, if it's, he's definitely, he's got enough cards in hand, so he should be able to do something. Mm -hmm. And you've searched and Jelly, so, come on. Yep. Only question is whether that Angeli was the good to search. The good to search was good to search. The good to search. I sound like Sapphire. You Starfire. just sound stupid. <laughs> you sound stupid. <gasps> How dare you? Even if it is true. Who the fuck is still trying to sell Magellan for 45 bucks? 
Not a fucking clue. Yeah. are still kind of expensive. Yeah, they are. Uh, Angeli is still kind of expensive. For so, a deck that isn't relevant anymore. So is that defender still fucking you good, or how supplementer? I mean, depends what, uh, depends what else you got. If you got a kitty cat, you can go kitty cat, Angeli. Uh, oh, okay, spell striker. Striker. Oh, spell striker. Yep. All right. And then Angeli, Angeli, tribute itself will get banished, and then yeah. summon. Does it, have, does it have to go to grave, or do you just tribute it? Like you just tribute it, like long fire, and then so it'd be banished. I think I'm pretty sure. Okay. Uh, sure, I guess. Where are you going with this, Luna? I don't know what you're doing, Luna. This is weird. This is really weird. Why? Go ahead you and look up, have... look up Angeli for me. What does it say? All right, hang on, let me have a okay, look. Okay, and then it. main phase two, you go ahead and summon. Like, wait, wait, do, what, do, what, are you, what are you doing? I don't, I don't know what he's doing. He's, he's being, Seriously, he's being. Weird. If you had hoot cake, I thought you were literally just gonna summon and go into a Zen mains, crash and pop. Yeah. No, no, no. You're gonna go on the defensive when you should have went on the offensive. You know what? I'm not gonna tell you how to play your fucking deck. You should have went on the offensive. Because the last thing you need. Uh... Yeah, that's, that's just it. You contribute this card special summon one Madolce monster from your deck. Okay, so it doesn't let me go to Graveyard, so no, you so it. No, so it can be that, you, that was weird that you went on defensive, you should have went on offensive, and now it looks like Mal's ready to punish you. Literally, all Mal has to do is summon a level 4 monster, which is kind of iffy just because, there it is, go into Castell, spin you. Like, that was dumb, Lunar. That was dumb. That was actually bad. You should have went on the offensive. Hmm. And I mean, you had an Angeli, and you had you had you could have done more. You definitely could have done more. Mm -hmm. Who would have thought that freaking evil swans would be beating Madoches? You would have told yeah. me that. I'd be like, nah, you're crazy. Oh, that oh. Bookamoon though. Sorry, Bookamoon. Yeah, so sit the fuck down. Yeah, sit the fuck down. <laughs> you thought that Lunar didn't have anything because Rhoda creeps up? Like, nah. <laughs> That's good. That was good. That was good on. Okay, I mean, like I said, you st still doesn't change the fact that you should have went offensive with the Zen Mage yeah. or defensive, because that Ophion wouldn't even been on the field right now if you would have just went on the freaking offense. Uh, well, like that, I mean, I guess you can go Zen Main, Zen Pop, crash into Ophion now, take 950, pop the Castell. Yeah, that'd be good. Mm hmm. So I guess you made him, you baited him out of a Castell in his extra deck, which is a kind of important card, so I guess that worked out a little better, maybe. Now just do something with it, Luna. Don't. Just do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Don't let your dreams just be dreams. Just, just do it. Do it. <laughs> do it. Oh my God! Shut them up. <laughs> oh God. All right, so you definitely know what to do, Luna. Even if it's simplistic, it's just going on the offensive of the Zen Maze. Just crash into it, detach and see material, pump that cast down. Come on. Come on. Come on, SpongeBob. Come on. <laughs> and King. No, I thought you were playing with your deck. I didn't think you were thinking. Please don't tell me the dog kids are going to lose the evil swarms, because that would be sad. <laughs> that would. I'm assuming that he doesn't know that he could just tribute. He could actually take out both of the monsters. He can just summon a jelly, tribute, summon something that's stronger than Castell's 1500 breed. Attack over the Castell, then he's crashing into the Ophion, detach, and then pop the Ophion. He can handle both cards right now. Right yeah. the fuck now. Just do it, Luna. And of course, as you know, uh, the Evil Swarms are not the best top deckers. It's pretty much correct you on a bust, so. It's. it's yeah, I think they're, are they worse than, than Six Sams or about the same? I'd say they're about the same. Yeah, Snuggle is real. So, and it's still bad. Top deck. Rail the Creek locking down that any backer that he could top deck? Like, hmm. So, come on, you got a prime opportunity, Luna. You just got to get rid of the Castell. Just get rid of the Castell. Just get rid of it. That's all you need to do. Just get rid of the Castell. That's literally all you have to do. If you don't get rid of this Castell, I'm gonna... You're fucked. I'm gonna beat you so hard. I can't summon my lovely pudding sass. But Shut you got, up. like, your fucking... Just duel. Your Angeli. You got, like, your fucking Angeli, dude. Summon Angeli. Tribute. 
summon, attack, attack, and face, pop. Yeah, because what's the style's defense? 15. Yeah, you could get over that. Mm-hmm. You got like, what, you got, are oh, you got that? I mean, okay, he's just now going to be like, pandemic. pandemic but... Okay. Fuck it, I mean, at least that's gone now. Yeah. And then I guess now we'll, go on the we'll now switch the good send mains to attack mode you better not stay in and defense. crash into the Ophion and Thank pop you. the Ophion. Yes. Do it. Do it. Yes, he's doing it. All right, good. <coughs> I was about to. I was about to fucking just slam my fist on the desk again and be like, just do it. Oh, that hurt. <laughs> 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 fucking. Fucking slamming your fist, huh? You hurt yourself? Shiloh Buff, more like Shiloh Weak. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, alright, so. so top deck uh, cranky on, go. Yu Gi Oh! I mean, you already got lucky top decking to another. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Did he do the mass wrong? Didn't he give himself 100 points more damage? Who? I oh, know he did. They know he did the math right. I'm an idiot. You did the math. I, I'm, I'm not commenting on math anymore because it is clearly not my strong suit. <laughs> You're the math guy. I'm the English guy, all right? I can do the fucking spelly stuff and you can do the, the numbery stuff. And then we we'll see. When I sat there and misspelled automatic like fucking. Wow. <laughs> automatically like three times. I'm like, automatically. O U T. No, 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 no. Automatically. A T. No, no, no. <laughs> Wow, you're actually just gonna take it slow. I, I would I would push. I would push hella lunar. You're taking this duel way too damn slow. The slower you take it, the more chances he has of top taking correctly on turning this door around and snapping your neck. So push. Push. You sound you sound like a fucking midwife. Push <laughs> the baby, push it, push, there you go. push, push. Hey, uh, then fucking tribute the Angeli, then summon a hoot cake, hoot cake fight, banish the bloody hoot cake from the graveyard, then summon something else, then... Yeah, you That's got right. this, you got this. Yeah. Hoo, hoo, he, hoo, hoo. Why, it seems like every single time you, you get bastard, more... You bastard, you'll never come again, near me with that thing again. <laughs> Seems like we get more and more inappropriate every single time we do a video. We do. We do. Yep. I think I think they like it though, to be fair. Let's see those two. Detach those two. Over here. Yep. Mm-hmm. Get your kitty. jelly. Detach the kitty cat. Yep. Get your jelly. Get your jelly. Go into tiramisu. Detach Spin the jelly. Spin those fucking cards away. Play. That's game. Suck. Is that game? Suck. Yeah, 33, suck. 3 minus 20. You can just yeah, but six. remember you can just slap the uh the Chakwala mode on top and it'll be 25. So it's an extra free. If he wants to do that, if he's like 300 short a game. He's 400 short. No. So. Oh god. Well, that's going to fuck Oh, around. never mind. He's Yeah, he's that's, game. that's game. That's game. Yep. That's he's game. The, 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 no, yeah. That's game. <laughs> I never understood why Madolt Chase players only play one ticket and one field spell. You seems like I mean, maybe the field spell one, but it seems like ticket you'd want to play it multiples, wouldn't you? Because when you get your uh, TR and missile off... because they can search for it and they'd rather go ahead and play more back row. I mean, I guess, but... I don't know. Yep. But okay. again, when you don't have the TR and Misu combo, if you have a ticket, then at least when it gets shuffled into the deck, you can add, you know, something back, you know? So the problem is, is that you only get one ticket effect per turn, so uh, if you draw the multiples, it's a dead draw. So mm -hmm. it's risk versus reward when it comes to that card. It's not like it's not like fucking uh, <laughs> whirlwind or something or factory where it's like, oh, ticket, oh, when Medoche went back to deck, all right, ticket effect, ticket effect, ticket effect, search three. <laughs> yeah, that's stupid. It's a powerful card, but at least they made it balanced. Yeah, they did. They didn't just make it stupid. Damn. Alright. Alright, people. We're going to go ahead and go on to game two. So, that was a close Cakes. one. That was, that, was, that was a close one. Cakes. Alright, people. We are back. Alright, people. We're back. what I just <laughs> fucking tell you? <laughs> Alright. So, this is game two. Match three. 
So the question is, uh, can now? Damn, <laughs> number generated out. Oh my god, again. Not for sure. Here you go, D for sure again. Damn. Yeah, come on, dude. <laughs> okay. Hey, let me just summon this 1950. Damn. <laughs> Yep, you and that yeah. damn D-Fish. <laughs> Pretty a, much. I already saw it. You applied a, a nice amount of pressure. Not too much, not too little. But, of course... Just see... right. No, it wasn't just right. If it was just right, he would have won. <laughs> <laughs> hey. So, that's, that's, that's cool and all. It's just, when you trigger, you get banished, and there's no point in summoning Hootcake, because you got nothing to banish now. You took, like, one of your best opening plays and screwed it with Doofager. So... Yeah, so, I'm uh, just gonna yeah. go ahead and summon a Messenger Lotto, and Messenger Lotto will get it searched, search for the fill spell, play it, talk over? I guess. Not giving you any ideas or anything. <laughs> no, you wouldn't do that. I don't care, I'm neutral. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> I just don't give a fuck because I don't like you people, so that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's not that I want you guys to lose the duel. It's just it's I... just that I don't like you because you're pieces. <laughs> no, of no, no, no. Not that I don't want you to lose the duel. It's not that I want you to lose the duel. It's just I don't want you to win. You to win yeah. anymore. <laughs> of course. <laughs> All right. Okay. No, no. I like my play better. I like my play better. You would. I think my play was better. But hey, I'm not in the league. I mean, I already beat Lunar. If I do <laughs> so. <laughs> yes. Again with the Zen Reigns. Alright, well, I mean, I guess that works. I pro to, Personally, I probably wouldn't destroy... Oh, mm, yeah, I'd probably destroy the Helio, the Heliotrope. I almost said Heliopolis. That is a completely Yeah, I, I was about to say, you all nice looking like you want that, to that is... check the Yu-Gi-Oh cards there. <laughs> that is a completely Pretty sure different it ain't mark. a fucking Heliopolis, just saying. <laughs> what do you know about that Heliopolis? I mean, I know that D-Fisher is tempting and you want to get rid of it, but I'd probably go ahead and, top, and pop the Heliotrope because you don't want him to summon and go into a Castell or something. No, not really. Pop some random ass back row, really? You got... The fucking monster that can threaten to cast spell you, so I'd exit on you. You got a freaking defender that's applying pressure. You go after the run random back row. You can worry about oh. that later. Yep. 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 So if you get fucked up, you can go. Fuck yeah. No, exit on. Oh, I just on, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I'd exit on. So used to seeing it, two evil swarms always go into fucking Ophion every time. Damn. I'm not, so used not to not Ophion that. dot deck. <laughs> No, because Evil Swarms would totally be played if Ophion wasn't a fucking card. That was a wrong choice. It was a wrong choice. I thought you had something when you went into that. When you went into that. Whoa, what the heck? <laughs> when you went you into went that. You went into Zen that Man. when you went into that. Okay. No, I was trying to think of what I'm saying. When you went into that Zen mains, but you just. Really? Random ass pop. Like, let me just pop that back row. It's not really a threat when I have two threats right now. Yep, yeah, there goes Zen mains. Both of them attack, and of course, then many attacks are on the field to result effect during the end phase, so no poppy poppy during, for Luna during the end phase. Hope it was worth uh, it. Uh, uh, I mean, oh, damn. Book of Moon, sit down. Again. And I there goes that pandemic. Look at me, I'm what talking all that shit. What is it with him getting fucking book all What's the time? What's up with him now getting defender? It's called number generator, brother. Yeah, no, number generator doesn't exist. Slight said so. Eliminate, eradicate, exterminate. These are the thoughts of lingering steel swarm souls. Yeah, you did it. What the fuck word is that? Yearning for a body so that they might make Eat deck. their dream a reality yes <laughs> you fucking did basic spelling i'm proud of you the words are backwards <laughs> well done spongebob <laughs> don't give me that the words are clearly backwards damn there goes that royal decree again i'm so busy you're fucking reading. clearly backwards <laughs> you're backwards oh damn well, <laughs> hey everyone knows that about me apparently you're the normal one <laughs> 
Wait, uh, wait, 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 what, what's, dumb, what's wrong, Mal? What's wrong? What's wrong? Book of Moon? Hmm? Hmm? No? Do you hate Book of Moon? Because I do too. <laughs> ah, he loves it. It's the best card ever. That, that, that card is so good. It should stay at one. <laughs> well, looks like shit's about to hit the fans, people. Oh, yeah. He's getting racked. Yep. Yep. And that looks like it might be it, people. <laughs> we already knew this matchup was going to be bad, but damn. Always getting that Book of Moon, always getting that Royal Decree, always just fuck it up now. <laughs> I believe in the Divisional match during the regular season, I believe Mal won, didn't he? Mal beat yeah, him, right? Yeah. yeah, so this is revenge. <laughs> He's like, yep, I hate Book. I feel used. <laughs> I love book. Book's so good. It is, I, I hate book. I respect book, but I hate it. <laughs> At least I'm wise enough to know that it should never go up any higher than one. Yeah. Unlike other people. Oh, I should totally go to two or three. I would love more book, book. book. No. Yeah, right. That's two gone. Mm -mm. And what would be seeing at OTK? I don't think so. No. 15, 18, 33, 33, 55. No. <laughs> no, I don't see it. I don't see it. Oh, I'm police sorry. helicopter there. Cause yeah, you police the helicopter. helicopter. <laughs> you knew I was going to say that as well. well I, I'm wanted. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. I mean, that's still not enough for game, so... You don't get much in blood effect because you have to control a beast type monster. But you don't, so... Hey, he is a beast. Don't worry about it. <laughs> like, unless Lunar has me on the field because I'm a beast, he ain't getting no search for this. <laughs> the fuck are you on about? No. <laughs> Hell no. Yep, attack, 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 attack. It's a nice chunk of damage, though. I do not believe that's game. Close. <laughs> I talked that that Regeki, even though that'll still probably bite you in the butt. Because you will get that search from Picket and get more set up. Is that it? Is that it? I think that might be it. <laughs> even a Regeki, I'm not even sure I can save him. Fuck. <laughs> can you go summon, yep. summon Exiton? Yep. Summon. Uh huh. Summon. Uh huh. You got another monster? Summon Summon Exiton would be great right now. <laughs> no. GG. <Gigi. All> right. <laughs> Even if he, you know, MST that Road to Korea and had the Phoenix Chain, it still wasn't enough. Alright, people, so that is it. So, moving on next week. We will Luna see... will be in next week, and yep. Tyler will not. Yeah, so thank you for being part of the league this season, Tyler. We really do appreciate you. <laughs> I love how you ah, good the joke. <laughs> uh, we really People do appreciate, appreciate Tyler. That's a good joke. Damn, that's racist. It is. Well, fuck it. <laughs> so of course, next week for the YCS division, we'll be having the division championship, the the semifinals. We'll be having Lunar a duel up against Ryan, who got the bye week, and seeing how that would do. So, what are the decks again? Go ahead and tell us. Alright, uh, so Ryan's decks are Klee, Infernoid, and Constellas, and Luna's decks are Clownblade, you send you a Medolce. Alright, so that seems like it'll be a good one. So be sure to come back next weekend, next Saturday. Alright people, thanks for watching.